case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the pivotal 1996 case of Chamber of Commerce of the United States versus Reich, heard by the United States Court of Appeals for the District of Columbia Circuit, an executive order issued by President Clinton was brought under judicial scrutiny. This order, which prohibited federal contracts with employers who hired permanent replacements during a lawful strike, sparked a contentious lawsuit that tested the boundaries of federal and executive authority. To backtrack, the issue that led to the lawsuit centered on the premise that federal law should supersede any conflicting state, local, or executive law. In particular, the president's executive order was examined for any potential conflicts with the National Labor Relations Act, NLRA. The lower court initially dismissed the lawsuit on the grounds that the challenge was non-reviewable. However, the majority opinion swerved in the different direction upon appeal. They found that the executive order and the NLRA were indeed at odds. The order was intended to ensure efficient and economical procurement by discouraging employers from hiring permanent replacements during a strike. Notably, the order had a far-reaching impact as it applied to all federal contracts exceeding $100,000, a considerable portion of the federal procurement procedures. By this measure, the order was understood to have a significant influence on the quality and reliability of goods and services offered by federal contractors, an aspect that underscored its potential ramifications for up to 26 million American workers. Ultimately, the court concluded that the executive order flew in the face of the NLRA, specifically because it mandated the hiring of permanent replacements during a strike. This finding, along with the revelation that the Secretary of Labor's regulations contradicted the NLRA and the Garmin preemption doctrine, led the court to overturn the initial lower court's decision. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 